I'll just fire away, whatever I want. G'day Blue Baggers, I'm here with our newest draftee, Maddie Prasparkas. We were lucky to pick her up at pick number three. Welcome to Carlton, Maddie. How are you feeling? Um, yeah, I'm feeling stoked um, to be part of Carlton now and um, I'm excited to meet all the girls and get my AFLW journey started. Yeah. Um, and what's sort of been your pathway with footy and that sort of thing? Um, I started off with the boys um, when I was younger um, at Romsey Footy Club and then I obviously transitioned when I was um, too old to play with the boys and to Sunbury Lions with the youth girls and from there I went through Cold Cannons and the Vic Metro programs. Yep. So you're a good, you know, just a honest country woman. Oh, I wouldn't say honest country woman. Um, <laughs> I, I am. I spend a lot of time in the city. Yeah. But um, you can take the girl out of the country, but you can't take the country out of the girl. Yeah, that's probably yeah, that's probably what I mean. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you find it a lot different? Because I sort of went from playing with the boys, under 14 boys, and then I played against women. I never really played um, junior girls. So was there much of a step up there? Um, yeah, I definitely felt felt it when I got knocked around a few times. And yeah. um, You give a few back? Yeah, I tried to give a few back when I could. <laughs> Did you ever imagine that you'd have the opportunity to play AFL? Um, not at all. Um, once I finished playing with the boys, I thought I was going to stop playing footy. And um, then once the girls team came about, and as soon as AFLW came upon, that's I think when I started working harder and I just grabbed it with both hands. And the last two years, I've just been working as hard as I can. And um, yeah, all the hard work's paid off today. And and what what sort of player are you? What can the the blue baggers expect from you? Um, the blues can expect me to work hard both ends. And um, I think for me, I pride myself on my strengths and being able to get myself in and out of contests um, clean and um, being able to use both sides of my body. Elite by the sounds of it. Um, and you and you play midfield is that right? Uh, yeah midfield and like small forward whenever I feel like. Oh yeah. You'd probably be taking my spot by the sounds <laughs> of it. So no, I'll crumb off you. <laughs> awesome. And what do you want to do outside of footy? Um, I'd like to work with um, Indigenous and like multicultural kids and um, I've had the opportunity to play in the um, Kickstart program in 2015 and then the past two years I've been helping out with some of those girls and I think just listening to girls' stories and being able to help them in, my, in some way and giving back to what they try to give um, helps me and makes me a better person and um, I just like seeing a smile on their face so helping those type of people I really like. Um, what else should I ask? I had a question. I did have one. I just need to have to think. This, is this going to be cut? <laughs> cut up? Oh, it is now. <laughs> I always find it hard interviewing. Like I, Can we I, interview you? Oh, you can have a go. So Darcy, how are you feeling about today and all the new girls coming to your club? Oh, I'm so excited. I'm waking up, you know, just knowing that you're going to get some new teammates and knowing that it's such a special day for the girls um, in the draft as well you know, people like yourself. Um, when I walked into the room here, I could feel the nervous energy. But yeah, it's such an awesome day and it just shows how much the league's growing, um, that so many more girls get to be part of it. Exciting, thank you Darcy.